fine. As the clock struck midnight on New Year's, I didn't feel super motivated and I mostly just took these past couple of days to reflect and reset. So today, I'm back and I'm doing things, whether I like it or not, because today is actually the first day of school. I just journaled and I honestly feel so, so, so much better. I've been struggling to keep up with my daily habits that I would ideally like to do every day. So I haven't been able to journal every single day or study languages every single day or meditate. I've been working out though. That's one new year resolution that I've been consistently working on and doing a pretty good job at it. This month I wanted to focus on resetting, starting over, changing, purging, yeah. So a couple days ago, I purged my bookshelf and I was originally going to film and just share a video of me purging my bookshelf, but honestly, I felt like it was pretty boring. I have a hundred less books now. What else is new so today i'm hoping to take photos of books to sell on my website and hopefully i'll be able to get that up i have two academic classes to take later today and i also have to teach ballet slash take ballet later today and i also need to run errands so i have a lot of things to do today so even if i don't feel super motivated i have to do things however after this morning's journaling session I feel a lot better and I'm like why don't I do this every day as I should it is my goal right now it is 9 13 I'm going to work out and then get ready which is why I still have my retainers and I still have not washed my face because I figured it'd be better for me to wash my face after I'm sweaty and gross previously I would always do that as like the very very first thing I do in the morning but then now I'm switching it up and I'm trying to like readjust my morning routine and I don't really know how it's going to work or whatever let's go work out Okay, that starts in five minutes. So, um, I'm just gonna try my best to clean my spaces. I worked out and then I was cleaning for a bit and now I'm late. I'm a little stressed. I haven't like, done school school in like a long time. Is this how students always feel? I did school last semester. Got this, I can do this. Okay, let's do this. Happy first day of school energy. We have some people. Are you excited or are you fake excited? And we're gonna take a quiz. Is that exciting? First day, first thing we're gonna do, take a quiz. Why not? It's the easiest quiz we'll take. The quiz. It's a good thing these answers are private. <laughs> but they're honest. That's what I like. I just finished my first class and it was a poli sci class and I am honestly so excited for this semester because the professor is so great, class is so great, I'm so excited. The next class I have is Chinese cinema and it starts at like 1.30 I believe. I'm also very, very excited for my Chinese cinema class. I was looking over the syllabus and basically we just watched a bunch of movies. I'm really, really, really happy with the class choices that I made this semester. I mean, it's not really a semester. It's like a quarter because it's really only a month. It's a six week long term. And then after our spring semester starts. So this quarter is optional, but I decided to take two classes and I'm very, very happy. Oh my God, I'm so excited to start school. <laughs> I 
just finished my second class. Pretty underwhelming. I feel like the first day of class is always super chill because it's just introductions, going over how the course is going to work. And I feel pretty happy and confident about this class. Apparently, I'm going to have to watch like a movie a day and then write an analysis about it. Honestly, not mad about it. It was one of my goals for the new year. So... I'm going to be watching a lot of movies. My mom went to go pick up pizza for me. So I'm very, very excited for my pizza. Almost every single one of my vlogs, I seem to be reading one of the books of the Poppy War. My one task. Okay, just kidding. It's not my one task. I realize I have a lot of things I did today, but every single day at the end of the day, I feel like I've gotten nothing done, even though that is very not true. My so-called one task that I needed to complete, and I forgot to mention in the morning, is that I really need to finish reading The Burning God, because this Friday, I am going to be interviewing the one and only Rebecca Kwong, aka the author of the Poppy War series, on Subtle Asian Book Club's live show discussion and I'm freaking out because I need to finish rereading The Burning God. I need to discuss with Tiffany our plans for what we want to talk about, like how the live is going to run, mentally prepare ourselves. Oh god. So, I feel like my day has been pretty boring and dull in terms of action. I've not done anything, <laughs> but I just spent the past three hours speed listening to The Burning God. I'm almost done. I have five and a half hours left and I'm gonna try to finish it by tomorrow, which means I have to get up at seven to listen to this book at two times speed. I try listening to it faster than two times speed, but it just makes me uncomfy. <laughs> Okay, to be done with the burning god already, and I'm stressed. Yeah, she needs to give me like a rundown of this book because even though I'm reading it, I don't think I'm really absorbing anything, and I definitely will need to reread it again immediately after I finish it. Oh, it's very frustrating because I was initially planning on annotating it, but then now I'm like, cramming this book so i'm not able to annotate it so i'm going to reread it again after i finish this live show <sighs> mm. i'm not ready to experience burning god emotion back to back I should probably go to sleep right now because I'm trying to sleep before midnight however since I still feel like I haven't done anything even though like I took like three classes today and bought class and also was doing other miscellaneous work. I'm gonna give myself more work and I'm gonna try to upload a portion of the books that I'm planning on selling onto my shop. So that's what I'm gonna be doing. I think I'm unhauling like around 100 books, maybe more than that. I realized that I don't really read physical books anymore and I usually only listen to audiobooks. So there are a lot of books that I'm getting ready of that I am still interested in reading but I figured I would probably listen to the audiobook because I, I almost never read physical books anymore or there are books that I really enjoyed but don't see myself rereading and I'm just letting it go because I no longer want to surround myself with all these 
things i'm trying to cleanse and reset you ever like finish your day with such a big list of things to do and you're like well i know what i'm doing tomorrow stress <laughs> however for the most part i'm primarily done with all the things that i wanted to do today and i am going to bed i hope you enjoyed my mostly productive day back to school please buy my books and read the poppy war <laughs> thanks for watching and i will see you next time bye